What could bring significant positive change at scale to communities around the world? Well, online communities are already changing the world. Every day, people share and discuss world-changing ideas within a myriad of online communities. But how can we translate all of this energy, all of this passion, into actually changing the world? We believe you do it by empowering these online communities, by allowing them to pool funds, to attract and incentivize contributors, and to effectively govern those funds and contributors and much more in a revolutionary new way. We're talking about decentralized autonomous organizations, otherwise known as a DAO, a DAO is an entity with no central management, regulated instead by a set of rules. DAOs empower their members in a powerful new way. Perhaps the most famous example of a DAO is Bitcoin. Instead of being governed by a central authority, it is instead governed by a set of rules, enshrined in code that bind the community together in such a potent way. Introducing DAOBall.com, a new form of decentralized application designed to allow its users to create their own DAOs. In just minutes, they can start managing financials, shareholders, governance, and much more. DAOBall's ever-growing feature set will help pave the way for an entirely new era and definition of online communities. As well as being able to create your own DAOs, you can also easily search through the ever-growing community of DAOs via the search function in the header. But before we do that, let's create our own. First, we'll need to connect our wallet, or in the future, you can create your own account. Then, we'll need to name our organization, and in this example, I'll name our DAO The Forest Fund, an online collective set on regreening the earth whilst wisely investing capital. Next, we'll need to configure vote settings, Within the DAO, these settings are used for all proposals, but can be easily changed at a later date. Now, we need to configure the shareholder settings and allocation. Although shareholding can be adjusted at a later date, it's worth mentioning that at this time, the total number of shares cannot be changed. Finally, we're asked to review our settings, but instead of going through the initial onboarding process, I suggest that we time travel together. Let's imagine we've jumped two years into the future, and let's take a look at how the Forest Fund is doing. And here we land on the Forest Fund's homepage, and we can see the community has grown to over 20,000 members, and that they're celebrating this achievement in the feed, whilst also discussing new logo and investment proposals. It's important to highlight that DAO believes in providing its community of DAOs with an amalgamation of decentralised and centralised components, and that, for example, shareholders, financials, and voting features all run on-chain, whilst the forum events and file repository run on Google's more traditional cloud infrastructure. It is this unique and ever-growing toolset DAOBall provides that will empower online communities to new heights. The Forest Fund being just one example of an array of use cases, and it is they who will bring the significant positive change at scale to communities around the world that we all desire. From the home page, members can discuss, plan events and manage the file repository. DAO members, however, are not always shareholders. If we navigate to shareholders, we first see the remaining unallocated shares, then a list of accounts who hold the Forest Fund token. Depending on the DAO's voting configuration, these tokens may weight voting power. Simply click the plus icon to create a new proposal to distribute unallocated shares, or alternatively, you can choose to transfer personal holdings this, however, would not need to be proposed as it's a personal transaction. On the financials page, you can easily track past transactions and analyze existing financials. Click the plus icon to deposit personal funds or to propose a new DAO transfer that will be sent as a proposal to be voted on by the community. On the voting page, you can examine all of the existing proposals and, of course, you can propose your own. Going forwards, We'd like to introduce an array of features, including payroll, Kanban boards, social, fundraising, permissions, and an app center, where third-party developers can build upon Dowball's ever-growing feature set. To conclude, I'd like to thank Block One and Google for hosting the hackathon. We're looking forward to next year's. And of course, if you have any questions in regards to our proposal, please do get in touch via the contact details in our submission. Thank you.